From fights to open containers and illegal street parties, Fox 45 continues to hear from residents at Fells Point and business owners who say they're fed up with the rise in crime in that neighborhood. Exactly one week ago, our cameras were rolling when a large fight broke out with the action taking place just feet away from police. Tonight, Fox 45 is back in Fells as tonight is just getting started there. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Vincent Hill. Let's get straight to Fox 45's Alexa Ashwell, who's joining us live from Fells. And Alexa, what's it looking like so far? Vincent, good evening from Fells Point. The crowd lively here in the historic district behind me, Broadway Square, one of the focal points of Fells Point. A common scene that we see here, the police presence here along Thames Street. We can see Baltimore police officers, some of the higher ranking officers also here, as well as area security guards for some of those area businesses. Vincent, as you mentioned, some area business owners complaining about open containers, uh, large unruly crowds gathering, the fight you mentioned that actually happened right here in, near the Broadway Square area, that fight between uh, two women just last weekend. I've been in touch with Baltimore police so far, uh, no problems to report. Uh, but as we know, the evening just getting started, the Orioles game just letting out. We anticipate uh, the area to get just a little bit more lively as it's only 10 o'clock and the bars stay open open until 1.30, uh, 2 a.m. Here at Broadway Square, what's become a common scene are these gates. And Vincent, I don't know if you were here then, but during the height of the pandemic, that's when these actually came about. If you recall, during the pandemic, that's when we saw the very large crowds here in Fells Point. In fact, many business owners at that time threatening to, in fact, withhold their tax revenue because of the large unruly crowds. Uh, there were a couple shootings in this area. Uh, and that was their response to that. So here we are again now here in 2024 and business owners, bar, restaurant owners, uh, some of them still demanding change here from the city. So we're keeping a close eye on the activity here. So far, no issues to report again, 10 o'clock. I'm Mary Bubala. Thank you for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also take some time to subscribe to our YouTube channel.